It wasn't too long ago that Luke Brown and the Blackford High School Bruins were packing the gymnasium. That was until COVID-19 forced a timeout across the entire planet. No more basketball games, no run for the state title. Like, I want to win a championship so bad. I think last year, man, we were, I know we would have won our regional. Um, I was not going to let anyone in that regional beat us. And then um, semi-state, we would have had a tough one, but we were playing well at the right time. But it all came to a halt. Everything canceled except Luke's workout regimen. It's a daily grind, multiple hours a day. Weightlifting and strength training and mobility and different things to try and stay ahead of, uh, ahead of other people. A new school year has begun and it's Luke's senior year. He's doing virtual learning from home and working out during his off time. He's preparing and hoping there's a basketball season this fall, specifically a full season. I would rather them just say no season than let us get halfway or to the sectional again and then cut it off. Luke, whose family is from Brownsburg, moved to Hartford City his freshman year to play for his uncle who had just taken the head coaching job. It didn't take long for Luke to reignite basketball pride in this small town. Bruin banners adorn downtown light posts. Posters reading unfinished business hang in storefront windows. When I came up here the first night a lady behind me said, are you with that new boy at the uh, packing sack over here? I turned around to her and I said, yeah. She said, well, I hear he's a pretty good ball player. I looked at her and pointed the finger at the people behind her. I said, you, you have no idea. You have no idea what Luke Brown's going to do to this town. He is going to change it completely. He arguably did just that, bringing his intensity, dedication, and high basketball IQ to Blackford. On this day, he put up 500 shots in an hour. Ridenauer, who has been Luke's personal rebounder for seven years, chases all of them to help keep Luke in rhythm. We would do the same routine, and he has the same fire and determination. He never quits. Even with the uncertainty of a hoop season, Luke stays the course. All he can do is stay hopeful for one last run at Blackford. Hopefully we have a season, uh, whether with fans or not, but yeah, that's what we're hoping for. Reporting in Hartford City, for Positively Blackford, I'm LaFay Pegues.